Minister of State for Health, Lauren Ibe Mamora, says the federal government will continue to address the health care needs of Nigerian people and redouble efforts in attending to the most demanding challenges of citizens in both rural and urban areas. He stated this shortly after commissioning the Infectious Disease Isolation and Treatment Center and other capital projects at the Federal Medical Center, Beni Kebi, Kebi State. We have details in this report. Detecting and responding to infectious diseases have been a major public health challenge in Nigeria as a result of the size and complexity of the country. Available data shows that several large infectious disease outbreaks have been witnessed in Nigeria. These include the yellow fever of 1986 and 1987 that affected over 2,000 persons as well as the large meningitis outbreak of 1997 that affected over 100,000 persons leading to the death of over 11,000 Nigerians. Experts say the year 2017 saw an increase in the rate of infectious diseases in Nigeria, including the Lassa fever, yellow fever, monkey pox, and cholera outbreaks. The outbreak of coronavirus over stretch health systems, not only in Nigeria, but even that of high income countries. These has elicited social and medical responses from government and private entities to cushion the effect of the virus. Over 160,000 persons were affected by COVID-19 in Nigeria and over 200 persons lost their lives, while over 150,000 have since recovered from the virus. The Nigerian government is making effort to stem the spread of the virus. Declare this place commission. In this direction, an infectious disease isolation and treatment center has been commissioned at the Federal Medical Center in Burning Kebi. The delivery of the health services is being administered within the context of the National Health Act and paying cognizance to the rights and privileges of healthcare providers, healthcare personnel, and the users. Only three molecular laboratories pre COVID 19. We now have over 120 in Nigeria. Shortly after commission in the center, Minister of State for Health pledged the federal government commitment to identifying specific healthcare needs of Nigerians and responding to them accordingly. It's a big center, you know, and the, the third phase already, uh, the foundation has been laid. It's to address the high figures of maternal mortality in Kirby State. So that's what, part of what I mean when I say that uh, looking at the needs of the people, looking at their challenges, their... The minister also commissioned other capital projects at the medical...